Welcome back to my walkthrough for GameRunnyOne.com. What sucks about this next level is that, yeah, you're gonna need an ice ability to get one of the stars, which is not until the end of the level. See, do any of these levels have an ice ability? No. Okay, but I know I level one when the ice star does. Let's go get it. Any ice ability works, but my favorite is gonna be ice spike. So you can create a giant snowflake. Which is why I have to call it the snowflake ability. Okay, there's the ice thing. Oh, come on. I'm trying to... Yeah. Hmm. Okay, well, some help would help. Hang on, I'm just waiting for that enemy to reappear. Have you reappeared yet? There we go. There we go, let me show you what this says. Yeah, giant snowflake. Now let's go to the next level. Music for it is awesome, right? Yeah. But this beginning part can really uh, injure you. But you can freeze a block. Or rocks, sorry. Hey, so you can, just by one small one you can get hurt. Oh, no, 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 I need that ability back. Okay, let's not die, Kirby. We can do this. We can do this, Kirby. There you go. <sighs> okay. Yeah, this level can be a real pain. Okay, get this some food, but just to be on the safe side, I'm gonna freeze everybody. There we go. Yeah. This is where the levels start to get hard. Well, yeah. Some of the World 5 levels aren't too hard, if I can remember correctly, but this level is a tiny bit of a challenge. Now you can say, oh, gee, dude, you, if you think this level's a challenge, you suck. Well, okay then. That's your opinion. This is my opinion. And this next bit, I believe you get to play as King Weedy. Yep, here we go. There's also a crystal shard in this bit somewhere. Okay. This little bit a uh, bit tough too, so be careful, okay? Yeah. Okay, let's get through this. You get burned with a bunch of points. And if you charge up King Weedy's hammer, you can break open the rock and or most rocks in one hit. Other rocks can already be opened with one hit of the hammer, like these skinny ones over here. There we go. There we go. There we go. And I believe one of these has a crystal shard inside of them. Is it this one? Yep, it's this one. There we go. One crystal shard down, two left to go. Out. Hey. Okay, here we go. Oh, well, that's the end of the King Booty part. Yeah, the snowflake ability, I just feel safest with it. Get some more health so I don't die. There we go. Got a bunch of fire, hey. Don't push me into the water, that can make me lose my ability, you know. There we go. Yeah, there's a bunch of fire enemies on this level. There's not one ice belt enemy though. Not one. That's why you have to get the ice ability on some other level. Any ice mix will do to get the uh, hey, to get the crystal one of the crystal shards on this level. And those little black dot things that jump out of the lava, those can be a pain too. But if you inhale them, you'll get the fire ability. Which I guess could come in handy if you just want to get through the- Hey! If you just want to get through this level. 
Okay, here's where you use the ice authority. Break that open, make sure not to touch the ground, or you'll get hurt. There we go. Now I can just ditch this ability. So, yeah, the next bit, a giant lava wall is going to come up to you. So it'd be best to have double fire ability so you can just blast through it. See, there you go. Okay, don't worry, I'll survive it. If I die, it's good to know that I at least got that crystal shell when you have the ice ability. Okay, well, I don't need double fire anymore anyways. We can get through the rest of this part with it with running. I'm sure you could too. Yeah, single fire won't do much, but I'll use it anyways. I got it. I'm, I'm not gonna use it. Okay, here you go. Now the lava starts to rise upwards. And this is the last bit of the level. And there's a crystal shard somewhere. Hope I didn't pass it. There it is. There we go. I got all three crystal shards of the level. Now I just gotta beat it. Well, good thing I got some food a second before, so it's basically like nothing happened. Okay. And make sure that you break the boxes in some way like that, otherwise you're not going to be able to get up. You won't be able to hit the boxes by having to hover gently. Shoot, I didn't get the enemy go- Well, I got some stars, which gave me a 1-up, but... Whatever, I gotta go now. Bye.